Yes, yeah, sir. Big Sweet checking in, man. It's all about that trapping at the trap house. As you know, I always uh, keep my foot on folk neck, you know what I'm saying? Doing my thing, thugging like a thug, you know what I'm saying? And I always keep in contact with the people that's doing their thing. I got some twins in here, you know what I'm saying? What's up, twins? What's, what's up, what's up? up? Introduce you yourself to these folks, man. What's up? It's the Birkin Twins. Birkin Twins, Alan. Okay, and y'all know world famous Mr. Hanky, man. So how, how y'all know this, this dark-skinned gentleman right here? How he know us? <laughs> oh, 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 Hanky, how you know them, Hanky? So what had happened was um, my man Rick, Rick Ross over at Capitol introduced me to them, and uh, here we are. Okay, shout we to Rick Ross. In. Yeah, we locked in, man, and um, uh, we creating a whole movement right now. You know, we got a new song, Spend It, you know. And shout out to my man E and G Boy over here in the corner, you know. So we made it one big old team, you know what I mean? Yeah. Okay, so twins, tell me what's different now. Thing that y'all, the fact that y'all twins, do y'all ever get a situation where people think it's like almost like a gimmick? Like, okay, we got twins, we did everything else. Like, how how do y'all how how, how does that work? <laughs> how does that go? I'm just saying, you know, the industry kind of rough. Yeah, me, we've been twins our whole life, so it's. Our perspective on it is different. Yeah, right? like, I don't know how I've to explain twins. it because it's just okay. like. But you know how in the industry, everybody like, okay, this might be like, you know, how somebody be like, I respect respected. You know what I'm saying? Folks be having a lot to say, especially Twitter. We Twitter never fingers. experienced that. Okay. Everybody we loved the fucking Birkin Twins. Oh, excuse me, I'm, I'm not supposed to curse in the radio. Are you, no, you got to talk your shit now. Yeah, everybody, no, everybody loved the Birkin Twins. Yeah, we never had that problem, not even growing up. Okay, so what's the difference? What y'all bringing to the table is different because it's two of y'all. Do y'all have the same personality? Which one is the asshole and which one is it? Um, I'm the asshole. We take turns I can tell. Though. Okay, I can tell. I, I heard I'm that. I'm the asshole. I'll, I'll admit to that. But you we do that. take turns. Like, yeah. sometimes okay. she can be... I'd be like, dang, you acting like me right now. <laughs> so so what's it like being twins having to share thing your whole life? Is it is it, is it a difficult thing? Because, you know, it's kind of different. I ain't yeah, got no twins. It has, so. it has its ups and its downs because it's like, if she does something, it's automatic y'all. It's mm-hmm. always a y'all. It's never just... Danae or Danette is always just a y'all. It's mm-hmm. never like it, it's, it's just crazy. we both we 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 get each other in trouble. If she yeah. in trouble, right. I'm in trouble. If I'm in trouble, she in trouble. Yeah. So have you ever got her in trouble when it wasn't actually her and you blamed her? Oh no, she done that though. No, you've she, done it too. Oh she's I've done, done that. it more as kids. Y'all messy. No. no. A little bit. <laughs> we toxic now. I'm toxic. Oh hell. <laughs> so how, so how's this dating? How, how's it dating? How's it dating though? Like, okay, when okay. you meet a guy, okay, this is this real. This is like the question that I mean everyone asks. Yeah, I want to know, but mine's got a little twist to it. Uh-huh. Okay. Now, have you ever met a man walk up to one of y'all mm-hmm. and um, you know, try to pursue one mm-hmm. and then end up liking the other one? Yeah. yeah. All the time. Yeah. Not well, all the time, a but a few times. Time. He be like, the hold on. The same guy would try to talk to the both of us. Like, yeah. if I turn him down, then he'll, oh, let me try the other one. If she turn her down, let me try the or, other one. Or it has been a time when, like you said, a guy has felt like I chose the wrong twin. Mm. Like, damn, I should have spoke to her. Like, after he got to know us, because of course you think we both pretty, then you meet, you know, you get to know us, and it's like, hold on, her personality is more my, right. my, my t- you know, my speed. So who's the sweeter one? That um, one. Me. Yeah. She I'm not, I'm not the, like, she, I'm not going to say that. Forget it. But yeah. Go ahead and say no, it. No, she better not say it. Nothing disrespectful. <laughs> say it. Y'all sisters, y'all get over. Y'all talk about no, it. Y'all no. get home. She, I get what she's saying as far as the whole God thing, but for me, I could never talk to somebody that... Already talk. Yeah, of course. Like, like, yeah. like yeah. even if you try to get her number... And you was pursuing her, and oh, it was like you don't like that personality. You want to talk to me? I'm not. Do, I'm not talking to you. Yeah, like, I think that. I think that's girl code. That's anyway, just girl. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I think Keep that's code. Yeah. Well, okay, what's the dumbest shit a nigga ever did? The dumbest? Yeah, like the dumbest, the I dumbest like... decision, the dumbest <laughs> comment. Is the just some dumb? What dumbass nigga you just remember? Like that nigga's dumb. There's a few of them out there. <laughs> <laughs> give me just, one that you remember. It's this, not just this, one. Come on, man. Give give me Damn, one off the top of your head. I think for me, the dumbest thing is them mistaking us. Like on some mm. pull, come no, like but no, some... but they mistake us on purpose, thinking we gonna fall for it. Like I know you know us apart. Right. You trying to play dumb? Like it's, it's kind of difficult. I dated twins before. I used How to tell them about their tattoo. Okay, yeah, yeah they, they do, do too. So, but yeah, they, they would have too. to be like with short shorts on. She got the tattoo on her arm. Yeah, yeah. That, I look for that. Yeah, or a scar. But or... That's same. That's, that's same. Cheating. Same. Hey, after a while, you know, especially in the beginning, it gets confusing. And but I be having to tell her, like, you got to understand, Danae, we do look alike. Like, you be acting like everybody's supposed to know us apart. But like, I can kind of tell y'all apart we don't now. Look that much like, y'all, y'all look alike, but it ain't like the twins I used, the twin I dated. Okay. They similar were like identical. Yes. Identical. yes, similar yes. features. Yes. I think what it is is how our energy is when we walk in the room, our mm-hmm. vibe. Mm-hmm. That's what makes people be like, yo, those are fucking twins. Mm-hmm. Like, you know, because when, when you first meet us, you wouldn't really be able to tell us apart as far as our personalities because when we turn up and we going out and we, we the same, us, we the same. Right. We, the we same. both on the same level. We go into the clubs, we turn up, we want people to, you know, fuck with the music and shit like that. So we on the same time. But see, you the twin <laughs> to give me New York finger popping like, you got me. Da, 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 da. That's what you give me. You give me the energy right now. Boy. Yeah. That's the one? Boy. Was I the hit on now? So, so tell me about this. Growing up in, what part of New York are you from? Brooklyn. Brooklyn. Oh, East New York. shit. Oh, Brooklyn. Mm-hmm. What's it like growing up in Brooklyn? I love Brookly
I and, love and first, that. hold on. Get used to it. They they speak in sync with each other. I'm I'm noticing. Okay. okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like they they speak like they rehearsed it. Okay. It's well, the craziest let's, thing ever. I, I can't wait to continue this interview. What, what, so <laughs> what is like growing up in Brooklyn? It was dope. It was dope. Yeah. Like so, how many places y'all grew up? <laughs> like, like, um, because we did live in the Bronx. Okay. Yeah. Our family is originally from my Vernon, mm-hmm. but we grew up in, in Brooklyn. Okay. So it was uh, it was different. We, I love it. We didn't like when we had to go to the Bronx. They yeah. still ain't got no grass in the Bronx in, in Brooklyn. They don't got grass That's nowhere in New York. York. How does that? <laughs> get? So y'all come down. So y'all go for a concrete jungle with the down south where it's grass and barbecues and and everything like that. Like, how? What what difference is it? Like, well, is we it, we. In the summertime, our family would bring us to the south. Yeah. So we okay. got the best of both worlds growing up. Mm-hmm. It wasn't a, a big shock for us. Okay. Like, yeah, for sure. You and, the southern hospitality. And, and y'all live on the west coast now. Yeah, yeah. we in so LA. what's that like? That's like across the country. Yes. yes. And I loved I loved it. I think that was one of the best decisions we made. Yeah, definitely. Like definitely. I just feel so like cultured. Though. Right. <laughs> I, I, I bet coming from Brooklyn, then going to New York, and then about to move to the south, move to Atlanta. I heard y'all yeah. moving. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. We, yeah, we re- relocating yeah. to Atlanta soon. Soon. Yeah. We've been we've been in Atlanta, uh, LA, LA for, for seven, seven years, years. Mm-hmm. since 2016. Mm-hmm. But we still going to keep a spot out there. Okay. We yeah. love it. It's we time to come it. out here, though. Yes. yes Focus definitely. on the music. Yes. yes. So tell me what y'all bring to the game, though. Like, what, what, what's, what's what? Mm, a little bit of this, a little bit of that. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. But what, I mean, what is it? Because, I mean, you know, w- women out here is mm. just like a different. I feel like this is the one of the times in, um, I guess, just in the, in the industry right now where women are really, really holding it down and yes. holding yes. their own. And I love and it. And it's giving yes. an opportunity for women to even even be real lyricists. Yes. Because yes. I think at one point, if you wasn't talking about popping your pussy, like, we weren't trying to hear that shit. Yeah. That is true. You know what I'm saying? But yeah. now it's girls I hear that can really got bar for yeah, bar. Yeah, you, you gotta, you gotta. We like to have fun. We do, we do. Like, we don't really fun. limit ourselves. Like we got a nasty, nasty song out, but it's like it was basically our alter ego. Mm. It's mm-hmm. called Dipped in Gold. Okay, I and heard that record. That's yeah, pretty nasty. Yeah, but it's just like that's not just us. <laughs> okay. That's, okay. Not, that's just, our alter ego. You see, we so, we're twins and we're Gemini. So what's their name? Oh yeah, Gemini's too. Yes. Oh hell. So what's so the, what's the so nasty many twins' name? What's the nasty twins' name? Um, Bougie and Ratchet. <laughs> <laughs> Bougie and Ratchet. Okay, okay, okay. So so what's what what else? Besides that, that side. That well, I like I love like women. Not that I'm gay or nothing like that, but okay. I just love my boss women. Like mm-hmm. I love women empowering women. Like okay. so, I like people that talk like that. Women that talk like that. We can come around each other, have brunch, and talk about business. Mm-hmm. That's like those are my type of friends. That's top my group tier. right there. Okay, like, top tier boss bitches. What yeah. about you? I feel the same way. Same way. Yeah. Okay. So we just like to have fun with the music. So mm-hmm. what, what can we look? So dipping goals out right now on all mm-hmm. platforms. What we got next? Spend it. Spend it. Mm-hmm. Wait, with your with your boy Hanky. Hanky. Yeah. Mister Hanky. So what's it like working with twins, Hanky? You ain't never worked with twins before, except the Yin Yang twins, and they not really twins. Not really. <laughs> uh, it's, it's. I mean, it's it's amazing, man. Like they energy is always through the roof, even when they like you know tired or whatnot. Uh, so. Like I said, they literally you can see them literally feeding off each other. Like it's it's the craziest thing to actually see. Okay. And like when they have things they want to talk about, some kind of way they literally like talk in sync. You know <laughs> what I'm saying? So I'm still adjusting to that. Uh, <laughs> I ain't right. never seen nothing like that. Ask one question, the other one answer it. Yeah, yeah. but it, it's it's simultaneously. Mm. It's like they share a brain. It's crazy. <laughs> mm. So, so what is it like working with this dude? Like, he's, he's one of the most, this is my good friend, mm-hmm. he's one really of the most humblest fun. cats ever yes, to, to yes. put out some of the biggest records yes. that, that's still charting to this day, still getting paid from him. He still ain't got no chain on. Humble. I can catch him in the club got, at the bar I got by a chain on the way, but they keep messing it up. Okay. <laughs> yeah. I had Let them know it's on so, the way. It's coming so, soon. Look, I had, you know like, what? And, and when, when I see you with the chain, girl. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to laugh at you because I've never seen you with a chain. I'm like, Hanky, you look stupid. Put that chain up. Do not do it. You're not Mr. Hanky no more, man. What's going on? It's been dope working with him because he has a fun personality. He makes us feel comfortable. He's not no, on a weird shit. You know, niggas yeah. can be weird in the industry. Yeah, they definitely yeah. Be. He's not yeah. weird at all. And I heard y'all be getting a lot of people weird sliding y'all DMs. Tell me about mm. it. How you heard? Cuz I know everything. Oh, okay. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Okay. But that the, was before the music. Like I know yeah. the weirdos. Yeah. Okay. I've been hearing your name a lot. You know what, what I'm saying? What not you really, nothing crazy. Like okay. you seen them twins? Which ones? There's you know, a couple sets of twins out here. Yeah. yeah. And y'all name always pop up in the top five twins in the in the, in the country. Okay. Oh, okay. oh we in, the, in the country. Yeah, in the country. <laughs> okay. You know, yeah. I'm worldwide. Y'all ranked. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. Y'all ranked. That again? <laughs> y'all ranked. Yeah, you talk about let them know y'all Instagram. Birkin Twins is B E R. 
K I N underscore twins okay. double S. So any tapes coming out soon? Mixtapes, uh, albums. We're we working, working on, on that. Okay, definitely been working on. But that. as soon as we get that together, we are gonna stop right back here and let you know. Okay, so I get the exclusive. Yeah, yep. we gonna my share interview. With you. I need the songs, everything. Yep. Yeah, we shooting a video tomorrow actually. Okay, mm-hmm. to what song? To um, spend, it. Okay. spend it. Okay. Yeah. yeah, and we also featured in a movie called Keeping Secrets, and it premieres January twenty twenty three. Yeah, working. Mm-hmm. Are y'all twins in the in the movie or? Yeah, yeah, we're twins. We're the Birkin twins in the movie. We okay. just featured and we um, it's, it's, I can't tell y'all too much. Okay, okay. <laughs> well, you gotta give us school. Let me know your Instagram one more time. It's Birkin twins. B E R K I N underscore, underscore twins. Okay. Two S for sure. Definitely. Congratulations. Everything y'all got Thank going you. on. Thank you for having us. Thank you. I already know you, my brother. I appreciate Come everything on, you got going on. I'm proud of you. Hey man, you my light skinned twin. Come though. on, <laughs> man. We both fall here. Yeah. 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 Too. I was like, he had a bald head. Yeah, yeah. man. Y'all, yeah. Yeah. y'all bald head, y'all winning. Yeah, yeah. you yeah. understand, man, man. Me and Stewie he came got a bald up. Head too. <laughs> like we came, we came up like bunch All of together. Yeah. a bunch of dope records. Mm. Um, dope. like just a part of the fabric of the city. So. It's always a because yeah, you're from Atlanta too. Yeah, I'm originally from St. Louis, St. Louis, but I've been out here for like 17 years. So, okay, wow. you from when you get locked up with these cats and get shot at with these cats and mm-hmm. you know all type of stuff like that, you you pretty much get your stripes in the city. Okay, uh, so we we gotta work on getting. Yeah, stripes. you might have to get locked up a couple of times. What? Yeah, yeah, just once or twice. Just uh, once or twice. I'm with, I'm with Eden. Uh, Eden been locked up a whole lot of times. So you know what I'm saying? Well, they, they, they big for like, yeah, They got they OGs. We going, we going to get locked up now and be like, excuse me. You know who I am? They be like, oh, my bad. Let me let you out. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? They're my cousins. They going to get their first strike tonight at 1145 with a yes, host in there. So yep. they don't know 1145, they... I need all my boss mm. queens. Let me not curse. Go ahead. I need all my boss queens. Am I getting money, Kings, to pull up to 11:45 tonight? It's definitely going down. It's going yeah. down, breaking twin style. That way <laughs> it is. All right. I definitely appreciate y'all checking in. You know what I'm saying? And rapping with your boy, us. man, trapping our trap out. You know how we rocking, man. Big Stu, what it do? You dig? You dig? I like-